Well, building my dad's Christmas present. I always go to my mom and dad every year, and I say, if you could have one thing that you need in your life, what would it be? And I normally let them choose the item. Uh, in this case, uh, my dad wanted a truck slide, and after researching truck bed slides, I was like, why would anybody pay $1,200 for a piece of aluminum on rollers? So I went down, spent $200 on some wood, and then, uh, you know, I got a whole other sheet there, but I'm actually going to return that one because I don't need it. Um, and I got all these materials. I'm actually almost done with the build right now, but... Um, and then I got some rollers. So, rollers. Yeah, so there's going to be seven of these and five rows and, you know, spaced out, blah, blah, blah. You get it. You understand. So there'll be seven of them in a row. So... It's only four, so we can actually space them a little closer together, but, you know, and then there'll be five rows of those, and then I've already finished the top. Uh, he actually had a, his own version of it, um, so I actually had bought another piece of wood to use to build the top, but I realized he already had something that he kind of built, and I just kind of came to the conclusion that I can already use the top piece of wood that he has for this. So, basically, I'm building him a truck slide for, like, $150. Uh, now, don't get me wrong, I spent $85 in bearings, so the wood was like $150 altogether. Um, I got pressure treated too, just in case, and then obviously some screws and stuff. But uh, And these were $1.99 a piece, I got 40 of them. So, I mean, but still, like $300 versus $1,200. I made this myself, you know, and I know it's going to work and it's going to fit his needs because I can design it exactly for the back of his truck instead of just a guessing game of something that you get. So I'll go ahead and finish this up and then I'll show you how this works. And if, anybody's, if anybody wants to build one of these for themselves, I'll go ahead and put the exact materials. And remember, you're going to be cutting this to the length of your truck. So uh, this was, you know, pretty solid design, I'd say. But um, yeah, so I'll show you how all this works when I'm done. And uh, it's going to take, obviously, two people to move this because that's two sheets of three-quarter inch uh, pressure-treated plywood and then some, you know, two by uh, one by fours. And anyways, well, we'll go into all that. I'll put all the wood in there. So when I'm done, we're going to transport it to the back of the truck and then I'll show you how all of this works. All right, everything's been drilled and measured by yours truly. Gotta love straight lines. Straight lines means you're doing things right. Okay, so it's pretty much ready for the top now. So I'll be sliding that piece into here. And as you can see, these will stop it from popping up if there's too much weight. And it will slide perfectly in between these two right here. And that's it. It just slides in, goes to the back of the truck. And then on that, I have to screw in two handles, one here and one here, so he can just grab the handles and pull, and it'll slide out. So now all I need to do now is move this to the back of the truck. So I'm going to go get some help, and then we'll slide it in and see how things go. All right, so basically he'll come back from his trip. He gets back on the 23rd. So the 24th and 25th, I don't even think he'll know I do this. And then I'll be like, hey, come out to your truck. And then I'll open it up and be like, oh, wow, a real slide. Lift one finger. Smart, huh? I didn't have to pay $1,200. Literally, it was like 250 bucks in materials and that was it. So I'll get two handles, one handle for here and one handle for here. That way he can pull or I'll just remove the piece of wood he already had. And I'll put two handles right here. We'll see. We'll see how I'm feeling. But as of right now, this thing slides perfectly. And you just put all your stuff on there and then be like, oh. Boom. Done. Easy as pie.